The second part of the Zone 1, 2, 3 program are the omega-3 fatty acids. Because the first part, the Zone diet, will reduce toxic fat. This is the driver of cellular inflammation. The omega-3 fatty acids will not reduce it as well as the Zone diet, but they can also, but they can dilute it out. So it's less likely to cause harm. And how it works is on three different levels, four different levels. One, it dilutes out toxic fat because, remember, in the membrane, you have all these fatty acids, including toxic fat. If you have too much, when the cell calls out to make an acosinoid, it reaches into the membrane and pulls out a fatty acid. It could be a winner. It could be a loser. If it pulls out too much arachidonic acid, you've got a losing hand. But by diluting out, by having more of the fatty acids, the omega-3 fatty acids in the membrane, you're more likely to pick out a winner and less likely to pick out a loser. The fatty acids can actually change gene expression. That's why they're called essential fatty acids. The body cannot make them. They have to be part of your diet. In fact, the only species in the world that can make omega-3 fatty acids turns out to be pond scum, also known as algae. But it's pond scum, which is the first living organism on the planet, is the key to our future. Because it's the omega-3 fatty acids only algae can make that are the key to our dominance today of the world. And we'll talk about this later. These omega-3 fatty acids also change membrane fluidity. They make the membrane more fluid. The re hormonal receptors can flow more readily in there, and when the hormones interact with the receptors, they're more likely to send their signal into the cell to be acted upon. And these omega-3 fatty acids also change ion channels. They can act as basically blockers of certain ions getting in, causing all sorts of bad things happening in the cell. In particular, they block the entry of calcium. One of the most powerful, most, most biggest selling cardiovascular drugs are calcium channel blockers. Now they have some problems, like uh, death, but other than that, <laughs> but omega-3 fatty acids are also calcium channel blockers. And that's why omega-3 fatty acids are so powerful in preventing sudden cardiac death. That's when you grab your chest and you die on the spot. So the omega-3 fatty acids do a lot, and that's why they're an integral part of our body, and if they're not an integral part of our diet, your body is not gonna respond very well. 